I'll fix these hood guns. What's up everybody, how's it going? I feel bad because I totally forgot to update you guys on the hood vents. So this will be a short video and I'll show you what went down with the hood vents. So let's take a look. As you can see, the hood vents are finished. These are Uniseal bulkhead grommets. They are used for plumbing. And I have a couple extra here. And so basically, in the plumbing world, how these work is you put this uh, through a bulkhead or a wall, exactly like would be here on my Jeep, and then you stick a pipe through it. And then the pipe will make the grommet expand against the hole, and that'll hold the grommet in place. So that's what I went with. That's what I decided to use. They do have a little bit of a profile, as you can see, but nothing major. From a distance, you know, you can't even really tell what it says or really what it is. So I had also talked about putting screen behind these and I actually decided not to do that and here's why. It's about purpose and my Jeep does not sit outside. My Jeep, yes, it gets driven, but it's never parked outside and it's never sat outside for more than a a few hours anyway you know like a day maybe but at night it's always inside so I never really have time for critters and things to get in there now if I was going to do screen here's how I would do it I will show you on the back side here I would put screen from about here over each one and then in the middle I would put a brace like you would use for woodworking and there would be a brace and that's what would hold the screen to each grommet would hold it flush across the grommet on the other side is where I would put bolts to go through to the plates so there would be a bolt here that goes through to the metal plate and then a nut on the back side and then the screen and then a bolt plate nut screen bolt plate nut all the way down okay that would hold the screen flush against the grommet and this grommet here is loose but I have to see if I can work on that a little bit see how loose that is um, yeah so same thing on this side no screens and I have two different size grommets I have a one inch is this size and uh, the smaller ones are a half inch so I've got one inch grommet half inch and it's one half one half one if you remember when I was drilling I did big medium little medium big that's how I wanted it bigger smaller and then get bigger again um, because I only had two different size grommets that would work I decided to do big small big small big and I think it turned out pretty good that way it's not super noticeable but there's just enough of a difference that you can pick up on it so now what does it mean as far as engine temperatures and under hood temperature in all honesty not very much uh, it's more for looks I guess than than purpose I really thought that it would help some 
and it does uh, if if I park this after driving let it run with the hood closed and stick my hands over those vent holes you can feel hot air being pushed out so there's definitely air being pushed out the holes so that's good to some extent the bigger thing is that heat rises right so where's the the highest point on the hood is gonna be right in here right here's your exhaust manifold also known as your headers and your intake manifold on the straight six it's all in the same row this is where the majority of the heat is so all this heat is gonna collect on this side well I mean it's gonna collect under the hood but the focus of your heat is going to be here just because of the exhaust and everything being on this side so truly what you need is like the high line louvers with vents and the back part of the hood i think that would do more than the holes on the side but again looks it's different it's unique and it does serve a little bit of a purpose am i going to do vents on the hood probably maybe I don't know hard to say I wish I had an exact answer for that but I don't so we'll just have to see what happens so that's what's new with the the hood vent stuff sorry I didn't get that done um, so yeah it's um, uniseal uniseal grommets you can just google it and find them they have all different sizes from two or two and a half inch down to a quarter inch i believe or even smaller than a quarter inch so they're actually really nice and i i think they were a good fit for the hood vents on the side i didn't want to leave just an empty hole i needed i i not i needed i wanted something to make it look finished not just like i drilled holes randomly so that's why I went with that. Yeah, that's really it that's new. Uh, I got some things coming here for under the hood that might hopefully make it look a little different. I don't know, we'll have to see. I don't know if it'll work or not, but we're gonna try something. And yeah, that's all I got. Told you it was gonna be short and uh, just a lot of rambling but that's the update on the hood vents if you guys have any questions about it let me know and also while i have your attention check out the merchandise because we just made hats and we have a new shirt design too so the link's down below if you would check that out maybe get yourself a hat or a shirt we'd really appreciate it and thank you guys for watching again if you have any questions or comments let us know down below and we'll be happy to answer thanks guys take care Bye bye